it's uh, it's Halloween, and uh, I didn't get in the woods till nine o'clock, nine thirty, something like that. I think it's ten now, and uh, I was trying to figure out why there was people everywhere. Everywhere I tried to go, there was a bunch of cars parked, and well, it was Saturday, but uh, anyway, um, I come to a spot I've never been before. Uh, there was no vehicles here, so I thought, well, we'll, we'll try it out. I kind of wanted to look at it a little bit. And the water's up like crazy everywhere now in places. So it, it kind of pushed me into a certain spot, which is fine because I saw a ton of deer tracks um, and, and pretty good deer tracks at that. I'm going to have to leave here about three or so to go do to go do the trick or treat thing, which is which is fine. Uh, I hadn't seen a deer on stand this year, so um, I don't know. Behind me, well, around me, I have a uh, soybean that hadn't been cut. It's been too wet. I got I sit in this little bowl right here because there's acorns everywhere, and I, the bedding is just right off over there. There's a creek that meanders through meets up over here and then another one that runs back so um i don't know um there's a ton of deer sign in here that's that's the most deer sign i've seen so that's promising maybe maybe we'll see something it's midday but man the weather's right for it so um it's quite possible they could get up and start feeding around here here in just a little bit i hope i didn't bring my stand I set up on the ground because I didn't know where I was going to hunt so um, I brought my ground set up and I set up here and I'm, I got a pretty good spot let's see I'm not backline too bad the deer will come from from the way you're looking so I should have a little bit of this I'm gonna put some more clothes on in a minute but uh, I shouldn't be backlighted too bad so and plus by the time they get in here I'll I should already have a shot, I hope. So, um, I don't know. Let's, let's see. I feel a lot better about today than I have most of them. ago I had a bachelor group of deer come out and uh, skirt the south end of this field. Um, one of them was a, he's a show enough deer. Um, I got very, very little footage of them and it's going to be shaky, but uh, man, I'm telling you, this, this one's a hammer. I had them, I had one pop out right, right in my shooting lane. I couldn't shoot it. It was, it just popped out in it and it was gone. And they were just making time out down the edge of that field. Um, so uh, I, I don't know. Might have to put a game plan together now on that. They went a long way. I watched them for a long way, uh, running the whole time. So I don't know if something got them up or if they're just moving around like that with all the people hunting today. I don't know. But uh, I, I'm in a good spot, pretty good spot. Uh, so. I, you know, only got a few hours left, so I'm gonna sit here and maybe, maybe they come back, or if nothing else, maybe a doe will pop out or some more. I don't know, but anyway, uh, that's the first deer I've seen on stand, so I'm excited about it. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it'll keep that up. And if to be that big a deer first thing, that's that's good. They're still bachelored up, which is, uh, I mean, that's about par for right now. They are to break up in the next little bit, but uh, hopefully. Uh, we'll get a chance at one. Mm -hmm. 